Hey everybody, welcome back. Thanks for tuning in. In today's video, I'm going to be probably doing the most requested video lately over this 350 Legend build that I've done. Uh, most of you have asked and requested that I do a 100 yard accuracy precision test, and that's what we're going to be doing today. So let's get into it. So a rundown of the rig real quick. This is a Davidson Defense 350 upper 16 inch barrel. A center point one and a half to six by 32 uh, scope, 30 millimeter tube. I got a CMMG dedicated magazine. And today I'm going to be shooting the Winchester Gear Season XP 150 grain at 100 yards. I got a target set up and with this being set up as a deer rifle, I'm not going to bench it. Uh, I got it pretty much tuned on paper as much as I could with the bag, but I want to see how good this rifle could be free-handed because I'm not going to be bringing a rest or my shooting bag with me out in the woods when I deer hunt. So we're going to do this real quick. I'm going to take a couple shots and see how on it is at 100 and then show you guys the results. I got a camera down range. I'm going to show you that real quick. Camera down range at 100 yards. So if you guys can see that, I got my paper target down there at 100 yards. So let's do it. Got one in the chamber. We're ready. One down, look like it hit up to the left a little bit. That one didn't feel so good. It looked like it landed a hair low. I'm going to take two more shots and maybe I could tighten that up a little bit. I think that was my fault. That one felt pretty good. All right. Last shot. These 150 grain bullets pack a punch. All right, put that on safe. Let's go down there and check this out, guys. 100 yards. Oh man, got my tape measure here. See how good we do free-handed. At 100 yards, I know the second shot was on me, it was a little low, but at least I'm out here practicing with the rifle right before deer season 2020. I'm getting to know the rifle better. I've only shot it a couple times, probably a whole box of ammo, if that, 20 rounds, and got it on paper back in the 2019. 
And actually, before I did that, a little crazy story for you as I'm walking down here. I boresighted it in my kitchen with the way I sight my scopes in now, boresight them anyway. And I went out coyote hunting with a buddy, and a lot of you probably remember this. I ended up shooting a uh, coyote on the run past 150 yards. First shot out of the rifle, too. That was crazy. So, here's my camera set up. Here's my target. There's my second shot. I, I could see that barely in the scope. Uh, again, one and a half to six power scope. And free-handed, standing, uh, the three best here, because I know I, that was me. Three best there, just a hair over an inch. Like maybe an inch and a quarter, inch and an eighth, center to center. And all shots, about three inches across but that was shot that shot was on me uh, again getting this rifle dialed in free-handed it is what it is uh, but no matter what that right there would have been a dead deer at 100 yards and I know it's shooting a, it's shooting a lot high here too so I might adjust that but that's a dead deer any given day right on the money uh, shots are right there if I was aiming at the heart, they would definitely hit double lung right there. So, And that's what this is, a deer rifle. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this little short accuracy clip. Uh, I know it's not uh, extravagant by no means, but it'll get the job done. And especially for being a new caliber, being the fastest straight wall caliber, it definitely works and kills some deer. So thanks again, guys. Hope to see you on the next one.